Yeah, hello, I'm here with Walker from Make Noise and he's got a brand new firmware for this contraption. Walker, tell us what it's all about. Absolutely. Uh, this is the, the Make Noise Soundhack Morphogene and we've added a new firmware. Uh, it's free update to all Morphogene users and you can download and install it from uh, the Make Noise website anytime you want. Um, so this, uh, this firmware adds a number of user-definable options to the Morphogene. Uh, what it does is the Morphogene uses a micro SD card and whenever you uh, mount a micro SD card into a Morphogene that uses this firmware, it'll create a text file on the card which you can load into a computer and edit a bunch of things on the, on the Morphogene in terms of how it behaves. So we've added uh, the ability to track volt per octave signals uh, from sequencers and things like that. Uh, we've added the option of a phase slash position modulation input, which lets you do audio rate modulation to uh, the, the sound that you have going on, kind of like FMing the sound almost. Um, we've added a new uh, version of gene windowing that uh, creates smoother overlaps between genes, especially as you turn the morph control up and a lot of like for that really silky smooth granular sound. Um, let's see, we've cha we've uh, We've also added the ability to uh, have it record only the input instead of the mix of input and SOS so that you could use it as kind of like a send effect, things like that. Nine different options in total. So I'm gonna show you the, uh, the phase modulation input really quickly. Uh, we have a little bit of a sound playing here and as with normal, I can kind of uh, go up the gene size I'm going to turn up the morph control so we can hear uh, some of the more smooth gene windowing. This is a little bit subtle, but if you are used to the windowing that's, uh, that we had done before, uh, that's the, still the standard default option, then you will notice the difference when you slide through that. Uh, it just, there's some cross fading, so it sounds extremely smooth. Um, all these options are optional too. If you don't do anything to that options text file, it'll just behave exactly as it did normally. Now I'm also gonna show us phase modulation here. I have a sine wave patched through the optomix, and I'm gonna go ahead and turn that up to modulate. I really like to do dynamic phase modulation here. Uh, so I have it patched through the Optimix so that I can... We also have a CV output uh, option that allows the CV output to become a ramp wave that's timed to the, uh, the length of the splice or the gene. So I like to use that to control of my modulator. Just a couple of the options there, uh, but if you go to makenoisemusic.com or check out our YouTube channel, we have a whole series of videos showing how to engage and use these options. So. I guess it's uh, downloadable right now. It's, it's new. Well, right now, yeah. Uh -huh. Just go to makenoisemusic.com and you can download and install it right away. And it's free for everyone who has a Morphogene. Wonderful. Uh, well, that's about it, Walker. All right. Yeah, thank you very much indeed. Yes. Thank, thank you for having us. Yeah, yeah. yeah. okay. Bye. So this was Make Noise, this was Walker, and well, bye for now. <laughs>